welcome to the lecture of helen keller the story of my life actually helen keller a famous american writer who is known for being deaf and blind being deaf and blind she never thinks of her challenges she never feels too much about her challenges or her physical dis- deformities she has overcome all her deformities and she has achieved in her life so whatever sh- the struggle she has faced as a deaf person as a blind person she has recorded everything in her the autobiography that is the story of my life let me give a brief introduction about helen keller she is a famous american author lecturer and political activist who become who has become deaf and blind uh, at the age of 9 at the age when she was at the age of 19 month uh, due to the uh, a very terrible illness she is renowned for overcoming these challenges and becoming a leading advocate for people who are like her with many dif- physical deformities or disabilities the story of my life is a, such an illuminating and inspiring book that was written by helen keller about her own life uh, about whatever being a deaf person being a blind person whatever the problem she has encountered in her life and how she has overcome all her physical challenges uh, uh, by equipping herself uh, with the help of her parents with the help of her teacher and on her own behalf uh, uh, and whatever the struggle she has faced this all that that she has very beautifully even uh, it is a life lesson to everybody uh, with some challenges uh, to overcome how to overcome all the challenges the book provides a detailed account of her early life education and the challenges she faced in a world where communication seemed impossible and further the book it speaks about her relationship with her teacher annie sullivan who played a pivotal role in helping helen overcome her isolation and learn to communicate let me give a brief introduction about the summary of the story of my life it was actually written in 1000 not 3 when kellen keller who was just 22 years old in the book she has describes many breakthrough moment when she may when she made the connection between object she felt and the words and sullivan spelled into her hand this breakthrough opened up a new world for helen and she went on to graduate from radcliffe college and becoming the first deaf and blind person to earn a bachelor of degree so this is not only an autobiographical book but also the book it is about a life lesson the, the book that teaches life lessons to the many people who are with many physical dis- deformities The book highlights the importance of education, communication and the human spirit's resilience in overcoming seemingly instrumental obstacles.